Okay, so hey everybody. So um I have been dealing with my the, the issue with my printer for like three weeks, right? For as like trying to print my newsletters and print off my shipping labels and everything. And my my scanner wouldn't work, my printer it was just nothing one word. And I was really, really frustrated. So, I mean, no matter what I did, it just would not work, right? So today it just hit me just uninstall it and then reinstall it and so when i reinstalled the um the, the thermal printer it it was like okay i pray this work so anyway i un um i reinstalled it but you know i had to figure out you know which one it was and so i styled it and when i reinstalled it y'all it worked and i was like for three weeks i've been stressing about my printer my computer because it, it it used to register to my to my um, computer, and all of a sudden it just stopped. So anyway, I'm driving down the road, and then God reminded me of something. God says sometimes that we gotta start all over. What used to work one way now doesn't work this way because you need to do an update. And and it's just so amazing that sometimes we can hold on to stale things stale thing sometimes we can hold on the or on the used to and we don't realize that when it stopped working because everything is time is always revolving it's always going around it's always something new so i want to encourage you if there is something that that used to work that's no longer working and is working different it just it's just not working i want you to reevaluate it reinstall it do an update you might need an update um, if just whatever the, whatever it is, you know, get your revelation from this message. Okay. And just know that even though if, if, if it's frustrating you and it's not working, that means you need to do an update. You need to do some reevaluating and reinstalling and just do the re, re mean do over. So you all have a blessed. I just want to encourage you. Um, cause God gave me that. And one more thing. Uh, I want you to take the time, you know, life is like, like the game of chess with the kings and the tween, the kings and the queens and checkmate. And it's a game where you have to study, you have to strategize, you have to really look and, you know, pay attention to that thing. That's the same thing with life. If you ever find yourself on a square and you're trying to figure out like, what do I need to do? Like, how can I do this? Take the time and examine and know that you are the chess pieces on that board. But God is the one who controls the chess. He's the one that controls the man. He controls this and then he controls all things. So by you just be a great player, you strategize, you just, you don't move until the creator say move. You don't do this until the creator say do it. Because if you listen to the creator, if you listen to the one who controls the game of chess, the game of the game of life, if you listen to him and listen to his sound instruction that he will show you, move your knight here. Move your king here. Move him. Move the here. Do the child. God will look out for you. He is so amazing. So I just want to tell y'all the word. Have a great night. Going to bed. Bye.